It's been a while since we have been in these apartments, Little Beans, hasn't it? Oh my goodness, it feels so crazy to be back here. I see they haven't removed the fourth birthday kit quite yet. But you guys, as many of you know, we've been recording so much inside of the beach run recently. It feels crazy to be back inside of my apartment. Especially with the weird lighting and obviously setting a filter so I can see myself. It makes things just a little bit too bright. But Little Beans, we have lots to talk about today. We are going to be reacting to your beautiful outfits once again. So let's get started. Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B, and welcome back to another video. As always, before we get started, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up on today's video, obviously subscribe, and click that bell so you never miss any of my daily Royal High videos. Today you guys, I am very excited to do another reacting to your amazing Royal High Outfits video. As you know, it's been a while since the last one, and I did say that Logan would be joining me for this one, but unfortunately he was not able to join me for this one, so it is just me. But I'm super duper excited, a bunch of you guys sent me your outfits in and I do want to remind you guys that if I don't get around to seeing yours in today's video I'm probably going to make another one with Logan in the future you guys sent me so many that I couldn't fit them all into one video so let's go ahead and get started and not waste any more time little beans checking out your beautiful outfit First things first, we have one from my friend Spawn here, you guys, who said I have an OC called Super Spawn. She takes part in Sunset Island pageants in themes such as good versus evil and heroes versus villains, you guys. And here we have Super Spawn, you guys, and I am absolutely loving the usage here of the beautiful winter sets, obviously, for the little capes over there. We've got the Star Frost set in here, you guys. This looks absolutely amazing, Spawn. And honestly, you 100% do look like a superhero in, in this. I can 100% see that. And I'm definitely getting a very Wonder Woman-y mix of, like, Superwoman kind of vibe from this. I love it. It's really good. Next up, you guys, Angie said, three of my favorite looks and then a Tinkerbell outfit I created because I love Tinkerbell. So here is the first one, which I am living for. I love the cute vibes you've got here. This is 100% something you would definitely see on the front cover of a modern magazine, you guys. Very, very cute. And then we have this beautiful picture here, which I'm assuming is two outfits. Obviously, we have this gorgeous casual outfit over here riding the bike. But I really do like the outfit you've made here as well. With the patterns included, you've really made a like modern kind of Vogue look. I'm really loving that. And this outfit, equally, you guys, is just as cute. This one looks like you're going out for a fancy meal or something in a really fancy restaurant, you guys, or walking a red carpet to an awards show. I absolutely love this one, Angie. And, of course, the Tinkerbell outfit, you guys, which just looks absolutely amazing. Angie, I love this. You actually really well represented Tinkerbell here. You've captured exactly what I would imagine Tinkerbell to look like. This is so good. Obviously, Tinkerbell looks just like this in the actual animations, too. So, literally, it's perfect. And next up, you guys, we have Haven here, who said... My Mermaid slash Summer OC. As you guys can see, this is Haven's beautiful Mermaid OC under the water there. It's a shame you don't have a Mermaid tail. I'm sure you don't because obviously they are no longer purchasable. But this is so cute. I'm loving the crown as well. Such a gorgeous outfit. And you guys, Addy the Heartbreaker said, These are my favorite outfits I got so far today. As you guys can see, this is a beautiful, gorgeous outfit. I'm loving the wings, the parasol, just everything is absolutely incredible. This is one of my favorite things I think I've ever seen. And I genuinely, genuinely love this. Absolutely gorgeous. And look at that picture, it's so cute. I love that you included the spring halo as well. Such a beautiful outfit. I'm really living for this design. And here is another outfit by the same person, you guys, but obviously going away from the angel vibe and more of like a devil vibe. I'm getting masquerade party vibes from this, and I absolutely love it. Honestly, this is really nice. Next up, you guys, we have Never Have I Ever, who said, here are my two outfits. And this one, you guys, is definitely kind of like a, I can see like a high-end sort of going shopping kind of vibe. Or even maybe going to play tennis and you put the skirt on over the top of your tennis outfit before you get there. I love this, you guys. Really cute. And this is their other outfit, which obviously has the opposite vibe, more dark and gothic, you guys. I love this as well. Honestly, you're also talented. And KF James Official said, I like B's hair. And here, I'm assuming, is some outfits with something to do with my hair. I don't know if you're just saying you like my hair in general, but if you do, thank you so much. But this outfit's so cute. I love how you're watching Jam Jam work hard while you're just laying there. And this is also their OC for this summer, you guys. Look at how cute it is. That is so beautiful. You've done such a good job with this. I love this, and I love the pose you've done for the picture too. Gorgeous. 
my two favorite outfits here from Mizumi, you guys. And this is so cute. I love when people start experimenting with like the other skin tones, like purples and pinks and stuff. Kind of going for those like almost alien vibes, which I really, really like. I love the blossom in the area you took this picture, by the way. And then a more dark themed one for Halloween, you guys. Awesome. I love the big wings that you chose to use in this outfit. And I love how you've made a kind of dear dolly vibe with the peg leg, making it seem really spooky. Honestly, I really like that too. And Lady WPG said, here is some of mine. I have a main character I use all the time, but I forgot to take a screenshot of it. But my pad is going to, my iPad, sorry, is going to die. So I'll add it later. Ah, oh, this is so cute. I love the cuddling teddy bear vibes. Honestly, absolutely gorgeous. And then we have a beautiful sort of like mystical elf, you guys. I'm getting a vibe here, like Lord of the Rings with like beautiful elves that are in that. This is gorgeous. I actually really like this outfit and kind of feel like I want to recreate this one myself. Wait, how do you make this glow? Can you do that? And you guys, last but not least, HM Chen said, here is my steampunk OC. And here you guys can see that gorgeous steampunk OC. I don't see a lot of steampunk designs inside of Royal High, but I 100% would love to see more of them. This is so cute. I love the hair color. I love the little hat, which really, really works with a steampunk vibe. I love, obviously, that you've used the cage skirt here. It looks amazing. And of course, the Shadow Empress boots, you guys. This is really good, HD. I love it so much. Well done. Now, you guys, I absolutely love getting to check out all of your outfits in Royal High. So very soon, we are also going to do a glow up video where I showcase your outfits as they were at the beginning and obviously glowed up at the end. So if you guys want to send me your glow ups, be sure to go over to my Twitter and check out the tweet I recently sent out asking you for the glow up so that you can be included in the video if i didn't show your outfit in today's video please don't worry i will include them in a future one i have enough outfits to make multiple videos so looking forward to doing more and maybe even getting logan involved again in the future thanks so much for watching little beans i hope you all have a fantastic day and i'll see you all in the next video see you later little beans goodbye